Hey everyone, today I'll be showing you how to create a bird comic book using various behaviors that you observe from your sit spot. So as always, the first thing you want to do is find your sit spot and then find some birds that you find interesting. Once you take those first steps, go ahead and start writing down bird behaviors that you're noticing. These bird behaviors are going to be used to create the story for your comic book. I've chosen these birds to observe to create my comic book. Here are some behavior observation examples. I hear a lot of chirping in the bushes. There must be a lot of birds living inside them. I predict this could be because they feel protected from predators. The way the birds pop in and out of the bushes kind of reminds me of an apartment complex where birds are visiting one another. I also noticed them eating food off the bird feeder. I think the species name of these birds are house sparrows. Using most or all of the observations you just wrote down, try to combine them together to turn them into a story. Start your bird comic book by drawing out several panels using a pen and a ruler, like I've done in my journal. The comic book should show a flow of events starting in the top left corner and reading from left to right. I started my comic book by drawing my first observation. I hear a lot of chirping in the bushes. The second panel I drew shows the bird checking for predators before leaving its home. You can use thought bubbles, speech bubbles, and sound effects to bring your observations to life. The third and fourth panel show my observations of the bushes reminding me of houses or apartment complexes. One of the birds wants to go visit the other bird's home to eat lunch together. The last two panels show the observed behavior of the birds eating together, along with some predictions of what the birds might be eating. Always remember to add your name and your location at the top of your journal entry. This activity is really fun because by creating your own story map and drawing your own comic book, you're creatively engaging with these bird behaviors in a way that's going to help you retain that new knowledge and information. Now I want you to go out and try. For more Bird School Project resources, check out our website or follow us on social media.